The Meghalaya EMRI Workers' Union on Tuesday had announced that they would be holding an agitational program on 4th December 2020 to request the government to take over the organisation and not call for tenders for privatisation of the EMRI. The president of the union, Ms. M. Imli, also announced their charter of demand and urged upon the management to look into the matter and to improve and take care of the living, financial as well as infrastructural conditions of the workers of the EMRI Meghalaya. Say that, uh, as this uh, GVK, this company, uh, the, the contract of this company will be end up on the 20, uh, 2021st of the 31st, 31st March of 2021st. So we would like to, on behalf of all, of all the union, I would like to say that uh, we request the government not to privatize this uh, uh, this uh, yes this institute or this organization anymore as uh, as it is a very, it's an essential service and we want that uh, the government should stop of uh, taking tender from the for the private company to come to our state so we want the government itself to take and take over this service as it is the essential service and it deals with the life and death of the people. So we just request the government to take over. Um, okay, our demands, uh, as for now, we are having around eight demands, the transfer and posting, the manpower or the, uh, and the reserve staff, working hours, working condition, the salary. As on that day, we have come to the office also to talk about the salary, but as per that uh, the talk well, last year that he said that we will be they will be they'll be giving us 10 percent so we have been but this uh, last week i think so we have been coming we have come to the office and talk about with the state of the head of state about the our salary but he said that this year we would be getting our increment that 10 percent also because of no fund there's no funding and then maintenance the, for the maintenance of the ambulance, then safety to women staff, then the leave that we are not getting, like uh, we've been suffering or, of getting leave also, then ambulance that is the manpower that falls under manpower and ambulance and base condition because there are many base condition uh, after going for a long after travel long distance to go for duty and performing the duty, so we they need to take rest. We need to take rest in our uh, the base. But the living condition of our base, they are not good. So for that also, 